Everyone has seen the images of plastic waste in the ocean. We should all be disturbed by that. And we are. In the industry, we're very concerned about what's happening to the materials we've worked so hard to, to uh, engineer and to down gauge and to make suitable for these different applications. Advanced recycling is one of several means that we can take to reduce elastic waste. In advanced recycling, we're talking about pyrolysis within CB Chem. It takes difficult to recycle plastic waste out of single use and puts it back into commerce, reduces fossil fuel usage, and uh, it's really a complementary approach to mechanical recycling. This could be and should be a very exciting time period in the plastics industry because we'll see a, a significant shift and where these hydrocarbons are, where they're used today, which is really uh, oftentimes landfilled after just one use, put back into commerce. We have engaged in a number of different commercial activities where we have secured uh, long-term commitments from pyrolysis oil suppliers, but we really need to work with these folks to grow the supply of pyrolysis oil and make sure that this material can meet our standards uh, for upgrading within our different facilities. We also need to uh, get the word out to customers and to the supply chain that Advanced recycling is very important for our future, that it takes difficult to recycle plastic waste out of single use and puts it back into commerce. We need better means of taking and securing plastic waste as the feedstock in the first place. The different plastic waste that you secure will dictate uh, what method works best to recover and reuse that material. For a mechanically recycled product, a very clean product that's one polymer type works quite well, particularly for ones and twos for PET and for high density polyethylene. For advanced recycling, we're able to use low density and linear low density polyethylenes, multi-layer films, things like that that are not suitable for mechanical recycling, but they do have to be relatively clean. And so we need better means of taking and securing plastic waste as the feedstock in the first place. The other thing is um, legislative uh, support. We really need to help our legislators make sure that they understand what the technologies are and uh, what we really need to be successful. We really need to define recycling very broadly to incorporate different technologies. We need to, uh, to have uh, more investment in recycling approaches and in separation technologies. We're excited that we're part of the Alliance in Plastic Waste. It's a global network, common goals, and love to see how we can do these kind of things collectively with funding major programs, with investing in emerging technologies, even little things like uh, the global cleanup events. We've engaged with those within CB Chem we're using Literati as the as the app that uh, the Alliance has recommended we give a try to. And uh, we've, as a company, for example, we've done uh, some campaigns to do just simple litter pickup, we've uh, removed nearly 200,000 pieces of waste from the environment just with amongst our employees in these little litter campaigns. So um, we've, we've even little things like that have become a very significant part of our DNA. And we're hoping to see that, that uh, influence continue to expand. This is significant work that's being done to address plastic waste uh, problems, particularly in areas of the world that, uh, that are developing, that don't have the infrastructure needed to handle all the waste, not just plastic, but all the waste. My personal driver is that I have two boys uh, that are now grown and I have one granddaughter now. And we need to work together so that the world that they inherit, uh, my granddaughter in particular, who is 20 months old, when she's my age, I hope that she sees a totally different world where we're not talking about plastic waste in the ocean as being a problem that's, that's uh, a big challenge. It'll be a story of, we had this problem, now we've solved it.